If I don't know what I think and I don't know what I feel, how on earth can I get my needs met in healthy ways? That is a good question. My name is Elizabeth Edwards. I'm a singer songwriter and I'm a person in long term recovery. And what I believe is that we are born whole and complete. We're very much aware of our thoughts, our emotions, and our needs as babies we cry out and we let everybody know that our needs need to be met but over time what i think happens is we have to adapt sometimes into some very hard environments and as we do that our thinking goes this way and our emotions go that way and pretty soon there's not a lot of connection in here and when we're not connected in here it's very hard to get those needs met and so we start pulling from the outside in and when we start getting our needs met from the outside in that's when we get addicted to things what that might look like is we start um, over investing in other people, places, and things that we have no control over, influence at best, right? So what happens is we start to have this lack of satisfaction in our life because the only thing that can fill that hole inside of ourselves is our authentic sense of self that's connected with whatever you know you believe your source energy is i mean i don't think any of us created ourselves here so we'll operate from that assumption but i'm not going to tell you what to call it or what to believe in i'm just saying that there's a sense of yourself that when you're disconnected from it it's very hard to have any satisfaction in life and when we're living from that place where we're grabbing from the outside trying to fix the inside that's literally the definition of addiction because there's nothing outside of you that can fill that hole it has to come from the inside it ha it's an inside job and what I learned is that when I wasn't doing that I just switched addictions and that's what I see a lot of and that's one of the main reasons I'm so motivated to share this technique is because how powerful it is to start to bring your thinking and your emotions and you're getting your needs met from that whole and complete place within inside of you you can heal this this is something that is a technique that will bring you back into alignment in your inner world and when you do that what happens is it empowers you to live from your authentic sense of truth and self it's an integrity it pulls you back into alignment you'll be able to live your thoughts your emotions and your needs and you'll be able to get those needs met and at, you'll be able to do that in real time you won't be waiting for somebody else to fulfill that need it's really a very empowering practice the other thing the byproduct of that is when we are living from that place when we are living from that whole and complete empowered place within ourselves our boundaries, we don't need to set boundaries, we have boundaries, and both internally and externally. So the, the quality of our relationship with ourself improves dramatically, and that shows up in the relationships we have with others. So if you are recognizing yourself on any level in anything that I have said up to this point if you're sick of giving yourself away in ways that you know are not good for you saying yes when you mean no or you're sick of being distracted and feeling like you're just dealing with the same old problems over and over again and you're ready to make some changes and make your priorities your priority then click the button below I can't wait to meet you and share this with you